What's up, friends? This is Jazz bringing you February's. Well, I, can't, I don't know if I should call it February's Gamers Pickup because there may not be one every month from this point on because but games cost a lot of money, but we'll say this Gamers Pickup. This is the other part that I was recording, the digital games that I got for Christmas and the last add-on games that I got because originally I already opened my presents and the one of these games particularly I was talking about for a long time that I was going to get when I had the money because it was so darn expensive and last minute she's like like I got about about a decent amount of money from my aunt so th this game would have been on sale anyway even with on sale it was normally a lot of money and she said well well get it now I'm like what I said but I don't have enough she said I'll add the last bit like after everything else she got from me this other game came in last second, too, when I saw it was on a really good sale. I didn't have to. I told her. I wasn't trying to ask for it, but I told her, well, this other game I wanted was really on sale. Like, I was just saying it's a shame right now that, of all times, it has to be this low on sale. She said, okay, get, the, get it, but that's it. So she got me two. I know, I know. I'll get right into it. I apologize, but I just want to say this because it feels really good. Like, I feel grateful for my aunt right like she some reason it's one time she understood like my need for it but I would have waited until I could have afforded it I would have as much as I talk about it I would have that she even after doing everything else and buying a lot of other stuff she said heck get these Merry Christmas and so I just had to put in the story so the first game I got, I will insert in the corner. This is probably not going to be monetized, by the way, obviously. But South Park: The Fractured Butthole. I know, I know, it's a funny name again, but I said it correctly this time. The term that it was meant to be called. I finally get why they called it that now. It was they wanted to use butthole in the terminal in the title because they're calm comedians, but. They wanted to make a way to make it clever, so they would uh, it'd be loud. So the joke was the team, the, the superheroes are fractured, but they're whole. I finally got that now, after watching plenty of videos, and I got it. But I think this game was really expensive, guys. We'll say when it's not on sale with tax in where country I'm in, Canadian. It was $91. You can see why I was hesitant as much as I wanted to get it when it came out. It was deadly, like in a way, how much it was. And it reached the first sale it had, it was 57 but $70 with tax. And we, it, we knew this. Like when I was talking about it, she said she will give the last $20 because I have had 50 of it. And she would give the last twenty or so dollars that it that it cost. That was our original plan. I walked in there to see it be thirty nine ninety nine. We got lucky. It was fifty percent off, so we got lucky there. I only she really only would have to give two dollars normally. Like I have to give her my fifty because I didn't have it in my account at the time. But I, it, it only cost her two dollars of her money, well, except for the other game. It really, she really didn't spend much. Luckily, it was good on her. And I'm glad. I was looking for this game for a long time. And I loved the first one. I mean, I had my ifs with it. But I enjoyed Let's Playing. I genuinely did. I, for sure, am eventually going to Let's Play this game. It will be one of my slower projects now, mind you. It, just like The Walking Dead, I will, I will get to that in minutes, or... No, not in mid. I'll Mega HTC. I promise I will get to that. It may even be in the development as this, as when this is out. So I'm just giving you that little, what is it, that little sentiment that I know you love that series. But anyway, this game, the self park, but the fractured butthole, will be a slow project. I'm definitely not announcing it until it is done, because of that point. But anyway, I know this was a long video, so on to my last game. The last game I got was Silent Hill Homecoming. You're probably wondering, 
you're probably thinking, Jazz, you've talked about re trying to record a Silent Hill Let's Play before and it ended badly. I quit. Yes. And the Let's Play, just like with the Fractured Butthole, if I do a Let's Play on this, this is not going to be announced until I've completed everything I want to complete. So I know it is a thing. It's that, that even more so than the Fractured Butthole. But this game is different in a way. It seems to be easier to not get lost as a start. It's probably just as scary, and it does have a little bit of troubles with certain things. I just have to learn how to do them. But it seems like the direction is not all crazy, like it was in the first Silent Hill game. And this storyline of this game, it it's exciting. Like I just love that type of storytelling. And I really want it. Like, if I if I, I was thinking of any Silent Hill game that I would enjoy, it would probably be this one. Now, there's, there's a story in this game. There's a reason I had, like, I, I want it. I was disappointed that I didn't think I was going to get it. It originally was selling for forty four ninety something which is no it's good for a price for that game that's normal. It was being sold for six ninety five. I mean six dollars and ninety five cents. I wouldn't even have to pay tax on it because of that it because of that little thing there. Eighty five percent off. Yeah. Like, I, I told her about this game that it's on a really good sale for $6. She said, well, that's it. And I told her I told her how much it was originally cost. Like, and even she said, you know what? With the, how much that normally costs, I had to get it. Even she understood that. Because it probably wouldn't get that good again for a game that expensive. So, I got the South Park and the Silent Hill. And those were two of my bigger things on my wish list. And I'm like, Merry Christmas! Like, I had a great Christmas, but I might make another video of that later. Hopefully I'll, like, I'm debating now what Let's Plays to really work on and stuff, so this gives me a whole new selection of ideas. I really do want to work the best of my ability for you guys, and I might just make a video on that alone. So anyway guys, this may have been a bit long because there was a lot of stories I wanted to tell while I was doing it. But hey, there were two digital games, so I didn't have anything physical to hold. So that kind of makes up for it. So if you enjoyed this video and the haul, give it a big thumbs up. And if you're new to this channel and you like what you see, you know what to do. Please subscribe because it would help this channel grow a whole lot. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!